Hey smokers, Strago one here. Now, uh, normally I don't do videos like this. I, I did a video like this a little while ago, but this is, uh, I guess you could say, sort of like a vlog kind of video where I just talk for a while. Um, I don't really do videos like this just because <clears throat> they seem a little self-centered to me. Um, there's a lot of people online who do vlog videos where they talk about how their life is going and whatnot. And uh, I never do that just because it's not about me, per se. It's more about what I'm doing and what, you know, like, for example, like an SSD installation. That's more about what's happening than really the person who's doing it. And at the end of the day, for a lot of people who end up watching, that's really all that matters. That's what they're there for to see. They don't really care so much about who's actually doing it. And so I didn't really, it, I didn't really bother even talking much about it but um, the thing the reason I'm making a video like this is just because I think it's time that I need to jump that barrier just a little bit not that I think there's a problem but I think that something needs to be said about certain things and people have had questions over time um, that hopefully I can answer here usually this sort of thing uh, and I'll probably go over it again but usually this sort of thing would have been taken care of in, say, a... Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and start the game here because uh, I just want to have something to go on in the background. Um, usually this would have been taken care of in, say, uh, a video with a question and answer. Everybody really likes those. Um, so, where to begin? There's a couple of topics I just want to cover. Um... I'm just going to say just right off the bat, this is going to be sort of a, a, a very real video. It's not going to be anything intentionally funny or, or joking or anything like that. Uh, I, I do that a lot. I'm not very serious then in my videos. Um, and I, we'll, we'll get to a lot of that along the way. But <clears throat> I'm just trying to say that I, I, I do really want to go over some things. Uh, some of the things have been kind of bothering me, um, to be honest. And... Uh, just sort of uh, go from there. So, uh, first of all, I just want to talk about the uh, weekly video schedule. Now, if memory serves, I'm not actually going to go look this up, but I'm sure you could if you wanted to. Um, the video schedule uh, has been <clears throat> going on. Uh, I've been doing a video a week for probably two years now. And I know there are people out there who do like daily vlogs. Uh, and if I remember correctly, PewDiePie was doing daily vlogs, and it just destroyed the man. He was just totally overwhelmed, and uh, he was he was just he was like done. Now, lots probably changed since then. I've I've seen that he's still making videos, so it's not like he's really really done. I mean, nobody's really really done. Let's be honest. They always they always come back, even though they say they're gonna stop. Or usually they just say they're going to take a break, and then usually the break's only like two minutes because they're pretty worried that either they're not going to get any money that month or I don't know, whatever. Um, but uh, as for me, how do how do I feel about it? It doesn't hurt me too much. I'm not I'm not really burning out. I feel like I'm. Usually some people will say they're like two steps from burning out, or they're one step from burning out. They're right on the edge of burning out. I'm probably six or seven steps from burning out. So I'm not quite there. But, you know, if I if I decided to do more than one video a week, I'd already be done. <laughs> so that, just right off the bat, no. Um, it it hasn't let up, though. You know, it's, it's just, it keeps going, it keeps going. Um, and that sort of leads into the next thing, which is... Uh, have I just sort of run out of ideas and that's why I'm making this video instead of, you know, an actual video where I'm installing an SSD and something. And the thing is, I have plenty of ideas. I have a document with over, like, a hundred lines of text, um, which, uh, with, with a whole bunch of different stuff. But it doesn't do me much good to have all those ideas. And a lot of you, and most of those are actually thanks to you guys, because you guys have made, gave some pretty good suggestions. Um, it doesn't do me too much good if I don't actually really feel that uh, sort of inner drive or that inspiration to 
to really whoa let's 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 dig in and do this and every week i pretty much have that sort of feeling and drive like hey we're going to get in there we're going to do it we're going to get it done and this is just one of those weeks where i just don't and things have just not been very enthusiastic lately um and yeah, I'm just sort of trying to like mindlessly play this game right now, and I'm just, it's it's gonna be bad. <laughs> just just <laughs> just to, just telling you now. Um, and so uh, the the first time this started happening was uh, when the how to make a Draga one video was where I was laying around like oh I gotta make a video today. That was actually a pretty accurate video as to what actually happens. Uh, like seriously, <laughs> uh, I will just walk around looking at things, and I, I'm i just trying to find some inspiration. So it's sort of like a writer's block thing, sort of like, a, you know, a musician not being able to come up with, you know, the next tune or whatever. Um, so it's sort of a, a writer's block thing, and I, and I just don't always have, you know, but the thing is, is that when it comes to YouTube, like, statistics and stuff, if I don't keep on top of, uh, keep on top of the game like and don't release videos for a week or two weeks I think it was game theory said if you don't release uh, a video for three weeks your channel is effectively dead I don't know if that's actually true anymore but it scared me into thinking that hey I should probably um, uh, you know keep up the the channel the progress I mean the, and I've seen people who are, are not at all impressed with the fact that I only release one video uh, a week. Like, that's not enough. And, I mean, I guess if you wanted more, um, uh, I mean, I'm not able to provide it. It's just not happening. I thought about, oh, well, Patreon, you know, if people could support you on Patreon, and then you could, you know, quit your day job, and then just do this, um, I'm hesitant to do that for a couple reasons. Patreon, I don't really, eh, I feel, I, I don't, I'm, I don't feel like really, kind of eh about it. You know, it sort of feel, it makes me feel like I'm begging for money for some reason. Especially since there's not really much I can provide in terms of actual good content. Uh, because, um, like, or extra content, like, exclusive content. Um that could really be any better than what I'm doing right now. I I just don't really see how that... I need a Ranger's Guild. No. no. Um, I'm getting a little off track here. Um, so, uh, anyway, uh, that sort of is just sort of like I, I could do more content. Uh, I would have to quit my day job. We'll talk about that. Um, there's just I just don't know how I don't have enough time at all to do more than a video a week. It's I mean other YouTubers I'm sure do that and it's just great for them and they have the time to do it and it's fulfilling and that's usually how it feels for me. Um, this is just not one of those weeks. So uh, I was willing to talk about things. And I don't know how well this is going to go over, and some of you are probably going to be upset, but those of you who like to hear talking before going to sleep, this um, video would probably be pretty effective. Uh, so, uh, on to the next thing. Um, answering messages. People do send me messages on YouTube relatively often. And uh, where's my marketplace? What the f Okay. Did I already build this? Yeah, I can build another one, whatever. Um, every once in a while people send me messages. A lot of them I haven't been responding to, and I said this in the crisis video, that I would, you know, try to keep up and, hey, let's actually answer some messages and get to it. And, and uh, a lot of times I don't end up answering messages because they're usually like, hey, can you send me a copy of Windows 7? It's like, I would love to, <laughs> but that could be like problem town legally for me <laughs> so um i probably if you're asking a question like that if you're asking some, me to send you something that you otherwise would have to pay for i'm probably not going to respond just because i can't really legally do that um for obvious reasons um 
uh, other other messages are for like tech support stuff. Um, I mean, I love to help everybody out that I can, but there's a point where it becomes not reasonable to help people for free. And uh, I like I, I would I would love to act, take the time to answer every single question on there, but I just can't. I'm not trying to make it sound like oh having to answer all these messages is a huge burden. I'm not that's not what I'm trying to say. I'm just trying to say that I'm apologizing for the fact that and why I may have disregarded your message. And you probably if you've sent me a message like that before, you probably understand, oh, well when the hell is he gonna get back to me about this? I need some help with this. Well, I mean it's I I, I my hands are kind of tied here. I it's sort of a little a little busy, so I can't really do all of that. So um so here's something that we've never ever talked about on the uh, channel and that is how is my life actually going um probably a lot of you uh probably have clicked off of the video at this point because it doesn't have like ssds and weed and stuff in it um this is really easy why am i not dead yet maybe there's a time limit i'm just gonna lose or something uh <laughs> the, I, I, I do want to cover something else before I get quite into that, and I, I'm actually going to skip a couple items here. Uh, if my content were to change, this is a question for you guys, if my content were to change, would you guys keep watching? And, you know, I see, it does, this doesn't reflect the whole majority, but if... Um, if one of if if I'm seeing messages like oh this this video doesn't have SSDs in it what the hell or this video is you're doing too many Mac things you're doing too many PC things um, those are all minor changes but still follow the same basic formula if it was to change even more than that would you just stop watching would the majority of you like totally totally just be done I have I have no idea. Now, I've tried to upload some gaming videos before, sort of like this, except I'm not actually talking about the gaming video right now, because, you know, I mean, I'd kind of like to. I'd kind of like to do sort of like Let's Play content, even though the actual idea of Let's Play content kind of disgusts me, because due to its lack of effort, uh, uh, especially with, you know, uh, what, what's his name, does just, like, totally unedited, long plays of things where he like dies over and over. I don't remember what his name is. I remembered it last time, but I don't know now. So uh, that's, I, I do want to show that I'm at least putting a little bit of effort in. Uh, it, it's actually pretty hard to talk while playing this game. I, I will say it's actually really distracting and I should probably play something else. Um, or I could just let it run in the background. Uh, I don't know. So yeah, this is a very low effort video, but I did need to just sort of get a few things off my chest because I did I do want you guys to know some of this stuff, especially if you do care about the channel and you want to sort of know where it's going because I'm going to be taking some input from you guys uh, at the end of this, and we're going to see if we can. Uh, I don't know if there's going to be any changes. Things will probably stay the same, but I just sort of want to know how you guys feel about some stuff. Um, so anyway, we'll go back to it. How's my life going? It's pretty stable. Everything's pretty normal. It's actually getting to the point where things have become a little bit complacent just because so little has changed over the past two years that uh, I've just been sort of doing the same thing. It's not like it's a grind. I mean, some, some days it does feel like a grind, but I mean, it's just sort of like uh, just a machine that just keeps kind of going. Um, and, you know, everybody has their ups and downs. Everybody has their bad days. Um, and they do happen, but uh, I don't really, I, I don't have depression, I, I don't have any sort of, like, mental disorder that I struggle with, so I mean, uh, that's, that's definitely a plus, um, and I'm, I am thankful for that, uh, but uh, I, I don't really have um, too much to say. I don't really do a lot of things. It's really just, I work full-time, uh, come home, chill out on the internet doing whatever, and then I go to sleep and go back to work the next day. 
for the days off. I just it's a lot of goofing off. Um, and then usually when Sunday rolls around, that's when I work. I record my video, I edit it, and I upload it all in one day. And it's not and it takes up like a good like eight or so hours out of a day on Sunday to do it. Roughly, I think. I don't remember. It depends on the video. There were some shitty videos that I had to do, like the Paramac G5 video card. That, oh, sweet fucking Moses! Okay, we're we're boned. <laughs> uh, uh, so I'll probably have to redo this mission. Uh, what was I even talking about? Yeah, this game's pretty distracting. My brain feels pretty fried, too. I really don't get a lot of sleep most of the time. And some people do better without sleep, without a lot of sleep. I don't do well without a lot of sleep. It really affects every part of my life, and it really sucks. So I would recommend that if you're not getting enough sleep and you feel like crap, maybe try getting some more sleep. And, I, you know, I, I, I wouldn't say that. Normally, just because you know, I I don't get enough sleep. I'm doing this on I don't know how many hours of sleep, and I, pff, I'm just blabbering. Um, so let's move on to the weed thing. I've got to keep at least a little bit of structure here. Um, I let's go over it one more time because I have talked about this before, and I'm actually going to quit this mission because it's hard as balls. Um. Hmm, that's a good mission. Maybe, let me try this again. Destroy uh, four sleep pits, releasing all slaves. I did better this game when I was a kid. Oh well. Okay, we'll start over and try it again. So the weed thing. I have talked about this before. What happened with all the weed stuff? Why is there all this marijuana stuff? Everybody thinks it's hilarious. Uh, I, of course, think it's hilarious a good amount of the time. Back in about uh, 2009, uh, was it 2009? Back in high school, um, somebody said something just ridiculous and unbelievable. I don't remember what the quote was exactly, but one of my friends just said something just absolutely ridiculous. And one of my other friends said, wait, hold on for just one second. And then he just, like, does this sort of hand gesture that makes it look like he's hitting, hitting from a bong. And just like, what you're saying is so ridiculous, I just need to go smoke some weed. It's like, better understand it or something. And then that just evolved as sort of an inside joke in high school for the longest time until it like became a part of my normal speaking patterns because it was used so much. And that just persisted. And so that kept popping up in videos because that's just how I talk. And uh, the whole weed thing is actually... I think it's kind of sort of like a social crutch because if somebody asks me a question that I don't really want to answer or know how to answer or um, they want to give me more input or I don't really feel like answering, I'll just say, weed. And it's funny because it's so random, right? And, but really, I, I've just been saying it for so long that it's just like, just weed, just weed, uh, just smoke it, just smoke it, dude, just, just smoke it. And uh, conversation over. Oh, holy shit. It's a little dark here. Some slave crosses going on. Okay, making progress. All right. Maybe I can get this shit upgraded. And we'll, oh, oh yeah. ADD, I tell you. So that has sort of increased more with the videos until finally it hit its peak at the 420 video. Uh, on on 420. That's uh, some big shoes to fill there in terms of a video I'm going to make. I didn't make a, a marketplace. Fuck. So, it's it sort of gotten a little bit, I always want to say, out of, uh, blown out of proportion. Uh, as kind of a joke. The whole weed thing, uh, people ask, like, oh, do you actually smoke weed? Do you actually smoke weed? I'm going to go on record right now and say that I don't smoke weed. In fact, I've never smoked weed. So, 
it's all just, and I think anybody who actually has smoked weed knows that already. So, that's, that's finally going to tell everybody right now, I don't actually smoke. I used a smoke machine in the video, and actually, if you you got to be careful about using a smoke machine indoors, because I actually permanently damaged my 27-inch display for my computer. Uh, some of the smoke particulate wedged itself uh, in between the layers of my LCD panel, and now I have like these ever-present like ghosts on the screen. It really sucks, and you got to be careful because it actually will set off your smoke alarm as well. So, uh, yeah, so I don't actually... So, now, uh, people have asked that question along with many others. A lot of questions I just don't answer because they just reveal too much information. I never expected this channel to get as big as it has and have as many fans as it has. And uh, <laughs> sometimes I wish it didn't have as many people just because I've had to make changes to my life that uh, are kind of uncomfortable sometimes. I, I just certain things I just can't talk about with people that I, I'd like to get to know, um, but I just can't because it would, uh, you know, get out and then people would find out too much, and then this is just sort of a problem with anybody who has any amount of popularity, um, and uh, I don't really, I don't really like popularity so much because it has some downsides, but it does have some advantages as well, and there's a lot of, uh, there's a lot of fulfilling things that you can do. Um, and uh, you can bring a lot of enjoyment to people, and that's always a plus. So it's not always just a, a self-serving thing. So, <sighs> whatever you want to make of that, I, I, I don't know. Um, where uh, People have asked me what I actually do for a living, and don't expect to ever find out what that is. Um, if you do, it's not because uh, I told you. <laughs> it's because that information got out and I didn't want it to. <laughs> yeah, I'm never going to talk about it, so let's just end that there. Never going to talk about the uh, what I do for a job. It's just not, no, don't really, not really willing to do that. So, anyway. Um, so, I was talking about changing content, about the gaming content, and... What would you guys really feel? How would you guys feel if it was gaming content? I've heard people say they really like it. They really like the the, the let's play kind of stuff. And then I... Uh, and then maybe some more edited gaming content? I... I don't know. I can't really see myself making a whole bunch of gaming videos. It, it would make it easier to do a gaming video than it would be to make like a computer video that I usually do. It, because there's no filming required. There's no pulling out computers, having to plug them in together, set it up, you know, get it working, having to wait for the fucking boot sequence off of CDs. Oh my god! If I left all of my videos unedited, you would see how long I've waited for the damn boot CDs to just launch up. I don't know why I still use them. I should just use USB, but I don't for some reason. And and I've waited many, many hours that I've just cut out that you just never see. It's, it's, uh, yeah. This is a, is a very cathartic experience for me. I might not even upload this. I, I don't know. Chrome. Did they kill us yet? Oh, they did. Alright, sweet. Put in... There. Put this right there. Bye-bye, money. So, some of you are already not glad that uh, I don't do enough videos frequently enough. But what if I did them even more infrequently? It has the, p the potential to not burn me out as much. Um, and potentially have better video ideas, because I have longer to think up of ideas. Just more of a sort of mental break gives my mind more time to just sort of relax and, and, 
and then sort of you get a better quality after two weeks. But, you know, then what if I need to take a break from the two-week schedule and I need to take yet another week off? Then that becomes two weeks without a video. So it could be a very dangerous trend that evolves, and it's not a very good thing. Um, and then if I switch to... I don't, I don't really know what this even means. I wrote this, and I don't even know what it means. What if I were to switch to different technology content... Um, like, maybe I reviewed smartphones, for example, instead of doing what I do now. I, I don't I don't think I'd be able to afford that. Holy shit. I don't know how they... Can... Not only do I not know how everybody manages to uh, review a bunch of smartphones, but actually destroy the smartphones. Like, I never budgeted that out. Those uh, smartphone destruction videos, although very addicting to watch, you just can't... It's sort of like a... Uh, a train wreck, you just can't look away. You just need to know what it looks like when an iPhone is, is smashed in, like, a hydraulic press or whatever they do. Um, what if I just destroy technology? I'm never going to destroy technology. I, I think that's just uh, just kind of shameful. Uh, you're just you're taking something, uh, a miracle that man has created, and you're just destroying it. It just that I just it just feels like the greatest disrespect not only to the people who work on it but the but the people who have to like manufacture those as a job you know so many phones have been destroyed by YouTubers and they're just who knows how many phones have been destroyed uh, but I mean they got paid for it they got paid to do their job whatever but I mean if you want to know the reason why I don't do it that's why. Well, this guy's just destroying that without any... Okay. I'm gonna, to, I'm gonna guard house up in a little bit here. Maybe get another temple, actually. Uh, ooh, wizard's killed? Yes. Uh, okay. So, uh, di a different technology content, if... If you do actually want to see me destroy stuff, I guess let me know and I'll see what I can do. It's not gonna be, I'm not gonna do it. I don't. That that won't actually help me that much. Um. Oh shit! Now it's happening. Oh no, they're just pretty basic. Okay, so. Okay, would you like to see change? Okay, what would you like to see changed or what should stay the same? Some people were saying that, uh... Some people were saying that, uh... The... Some of the stuff I was doing is getting kind of old. Like, doing the same sort of thing over and over again, and like the SSDs in every single video probably would get to people after a while I imagine but there's way too much of that and you know we can we can talk um, I also right here the formula is quite played out yeah maybe a little bit maybe I'm just tired maybe it's, this is all just I need more sleep I, I don't know um, but I do love every single one of you guys, um, just uh, just because uh, you know you're all very very kind to me uh, in the comments. Um, you're all very nice people. I I haven't had I haven't really had that much of a problem with very many of you. Um, a lot of people didn't like the uh, the Windows 98 on an SSD video. I guess because maybe it was kind of like clickbaity or not, not really clickbaity but maybe a little inaccurate or it sucked or I suck um, I'm gonna die here probably unless I do this but I don't have enough money I think I can fight this off yeah a lot, a lot of people didn't like that video I got the most views I've ever had on any video which was just weird so it ended up getting benefiting from YouTube's 
promotion system, and it hit the front page a few times. Same thing with the Minecraft video. It brought in a lot of people. <clears throat> Some of them didn't like the content, whatever. Um, and then I just typed new stuff at the bottom. I don't know what that means. Oh, uh, if you guys like videos like this where I talk unscripted, I'm not scripted. That, that's oh, that's another thing. None of my videos are scripted. Most of the time, I don't come up with an idea for a video until I'm like two things in. Uh, I don't even know what that means. <laughs> when I'm uh, the same day, like within two minutes of me actually starting working on the video, like I don't know what I'm going to do for it. It just hits me. I'm like, oh, we'll do this with the iBook this week. And uh, I probably should have done the iBook actual Amiga OS because I did so little research that actually, um, oh, what the fuck, that actually I thought I was installing the Amiga OS. And it was just called Morph OS. But no, there's actually just Amiga OS. And it's much better than... <laughs> uh, but then again, I don't even know that much about Amigas, so I'll probably just not cover the relevant things to people who know about Amiga stuff. Um, I guess you could say I get kind of lazy with my videos. Um, just about just not having to research stuff. I guess because it's just I don't really have a lot of time, and I just want to relax a lot of the time um, on my days off. Because I guess you could kind of call Sunday not a day off if I'm working on a video. Because nowadays people think that working on videos is work now. And I, I have to agree with them because, you know, I do put in a lot of hours working on them. And, I mean, you know, somebody's got to do that. And that's that's not necessarily always playtime. And there are times where I just do not like editing. Oh, sweet. Hmm, I'm actually not doing too bad now. Where's the slave pit? I think we covered everything. I think that's it. How long have I been doing this for? Oh, only a half an hour? You guys want, like, hour-long videos. I don't know if any of you guys remember, but I used to do 15-minute videos back in 2014. I did a 45-minute one, long one, that one time, because it was the 5,000 subscriber special, and the video got so complicated with transferring files all over the place, and not formatting the flash drives right, that eventually I lost my crypto chick shit. Fire. Oh yeah, you can really see that the ADD of this game is, is really kicking in now, and... I think we did everything. Oh, uh, the, the length of the videos, yes. Uh, 45 minutes. Um, that was a really long video at the time. Like a long video. Because before I was doing like 15 minutes, and that was it. And then the next one was an hour, and then the next one was an hour. And, then, and I don't know how that happened. Or how I just suddenly got into things that were super complicated. Maybe I was just editing stuff out more before. But I will say that every single video I make, with probably the exception of this one, is very heavily edited considerably and this might be the first one that I'm actually like is totally raw I think the other one that's totally raw is the podcast length screensaver one but I think even that one had some cuts in it um, so yeah I guess I'd like to know if you guys want vlog type content it really pains me to make this video I'll tell you guys that right now I believe that while I'm making this video I'm upsetting you guys because it's not what you want to see you're not seeing I'm not I'm just being lazy and I'm just telling you things that you don't want to hear uh, you don't want to see who gives a fuck about majesty right and and you'll, you'll just be like I'm done with you dude eh. 
you know, it's, that's why I'm probably going to hesitate before I upload this, because I'm going to be like, oh my god, this is, this is different. This is a lot different. Oh, here it is. It's not down here. Shit. God, my wizards suck. Fuck, okay. I hope the, gob the goblin the hobgoblin lord shit doesn't come from the corner again. Okay, we can do this. So yeah, this is this is majesty. I've been playing this since 2003. Or I got the game in 2003 and played it, but. Here we go. So I guess that really covers everything. Uh, there's probably more things. But that's for episode two of the vlog, right? Like, that's coming, right? I, I did episode one. I, I I have a really bad commitment problem when it comes to episodic releases. Um, did okay with the Power Mac G4. Didn't do okay with the Power Mac G5. Didn't do okay with the Deck Talk. Didn't do okay with Doom. All of those had like one episode each. So, you know. Maybe I should just go back and finish those. Get at least three episodes on each of those. Flesh those out a little bit. Ooh. Oh, I just realized I have a lot of houses down here that automatically got created because there's no actual population support for these people. Oh, there it is. Take all my money. Actually, I need to upgrade. Oh, fuck. So I guess for the rest of this, uh, you'll just watch me play the rest of this mission, which is Free the Slaves. This is uh, this is an advanced campaign mission, and uh, it is something that I believe was probably the most memorable one I played when I was playing this as a kid, because I think it's the only really tough one. It's not really that tough that I actually beat. So, and I was like, yeah, we did it. It was really difficult but I did it so so yeah for those of you who are legitimately disappointed that this is not a video you were looking for this week <laughs> I'm sorry and most likely the next video next week will be exactly the same as every other video and go back to normal because uh, if if it turns out that a lot of you do not like this type of video and really don't give a shit about what's going on with me or in my life, you just want me to make videos and forget about it, that's fine. But you gotta tell me that. You gotta put that in the comment. Um, generally, I think... Um... What the fuck? The final boss is just hanging around my face. <laughs> I think I, I just I looked on several videos, and you can do this on any YouTube video, and I think it still holds true to this day. But basically, every video, um, you get a certain amount of views. But you look at the comment to view ratio, you only get a very small fraction of comments for every for every couple of views. What the hell? So like, if you have a video that has like a hundred thousand views, it's only gonna have like say about a thousand comments probably less. If you have one that has a million, it might only have like 50,000 or less. So generally most people just watch and they don't bother commenting, especially since a lot of YouTube uh, commenting sections are very, very toxic places or very, very insane places. Um, so, uh, and that's one thing that really surprises me above a lot of things is that the comments on my videos are usually pretty peaceful, pretty reasonable. Hey, I did it. Um, I didn't even get to see the battle, but oh well. <laughs> so, uh, what was I talking about? Crap.
Oh, there, there was the battle. I got two hundred twenty-five dollars each. So, maybe it's just one of those days, you know. Well, guys, I guess thanks for watching. Sticking with the channel as long as some of you have. Uh, and, and all that. Uh, I am... I do appreciate that you guys are sticking with me. Um, probably a lot of you guys, if, if some of you guys are new from the Portal video, that one sort of got a lot of views right away. Um, if some of you guys are new from the Portal video, welcome. Um... You are real troopers for sitting through this much of a video. Uh, usually, you know, people don't want to want to listen to me go on like this, and probably will not. We'll just wait until next week. So uh, I guess they'll just be patient until another regular video comes out. So I I look forward to hearing some of the comments that you guys are going to leave for this video because you're going to figure out very quickly that I'm very tired. And I probably should not have made this video. It's going to be a huge mistake, and I'm just going to regret it for the rest of my life. So um, let's hope that doesn't happen. And um, yeah. So yeah, I guess thanks for watching, and I will maybe see you guys next time. Take care.